So I just want to start by congratulating you on the smart decision that you've already made. Becoming a junior executive positions you turn 100% of the overrides and residuals from your team. What also happens is you have an unlimited ability, unlimited $500 bonuses, $1,000 bonuses, $10,000 bonuses. You can man, earn as many of those as you want. And we got the ability for you to go out in the first 100 days. And I know you're just getting started the, the, in the first 100 days and, and earn $60,000 in income. Now, I want you to think about this just for a second, because it costs nothing to go for this. You don't have to pay any money extra to go for this. It comes with it, it, every person who makes the decision to become a junior executive, has the ability to go out there in 100 days and earn, earn, earn over $60,000. I want you to know this. There is no company in our industry that can match the income potential of Surge 365. And what we're going to do is we're going to look at, well, how do I, how do I make that money? What, what, in other words, what are people doing so that I can get compensated? Well, I'm going to start with the question. So if you had more time and you had more money, in other words, time was no object. Money was no consideration. You could do whatever you want as long as you wanted. When it, folks, what would you do more of? And here's what I found when I asked this question. Either people say travel or something that revolves around travel, like be, spend more time with family, those kind of things, which is why travel is the world's largest industry, $9.6 trillion per year is in travel. Now, what we're going to show you is how you can be profitable in travel with minimal effort. We're going to show you multiple ways that you can make money in travel with absolutely no experience. Kind of let, let, me, let me tell you how that works. Somebody you know. Now, this may be a coworker, a friend, a relative, a neighbor, someone in church. But here's what we can almost with, with certainty say. Someone you know is going to purchase travel online this week. Don't know who, but someone will. And they're typically going to check three sites. Now, you say, well, why do people check three sites? Pretty simple. Price. <laughs> that's why people check multiple sites they want to make sure they're getting the best price and what if when they go to check those three sites what if two of those were yours see i want you to, i want you to know this will be your travel site it's powered by priceline it means it's it, so we have gone out got to deal with priceline it is will be labeled your site you can name it whatever you want but priceline is the one who's supplying the pricing they're doing all of the fulfillment and folks, what I want you to know is that is one of your sites. There's another site. It's called the Vortex. Well, what, what, what's different about the Vortex? Well, the Vortex has prices that are lower than you can get on public sites, which means you have to have a password. You have to create a username and password. So that is, those are your two sites. And here's what I want you to know. All you're doing is pointing people. You're not teaching them how to use the site. You're not going through and saying, what are you looking for? Let's go look here. Let's check. See, people are already doing the work. They're already going on late at night, early in the morning, on the weekends. They're checking. Sometimes they're checking without even going. They just, they just want to, man, just look, I'm looking for, maybe there's a deal. And all you have to do is point them to your sites. And here's what they're going to see. This is Expedia, you, you, who you've heard of, all right? And this is going into to staying in Manhattan, actually in Chelsea, for three nights. So this is a long weekend in October. And you can see that the price on Expedia and the price on your travel site is exactly the same. $459. Both sites are going to send a confirmation. Both sites will be there to, to be able to help if something should go wrong. But the difference between Expedia and your travel site is when your friend, and, and let, me, let me just ask you this. Let's, let's, let's just reverse this. Your friend comes to you and says, hey, I've got a site for travel. Here's, the, here, here's, the, here's how you get there. When you book travel next time, would you at least consider using my site? And if it's the same price or less, would you buy from me? And here's what I, here's what I find out every time I ask that question. Everybody says, Absolutely, I'd do that for my friend. Well, if you do that for your friend, then your friends are probably the same way. They'll do it for you. But look at this. They're going to the same place. They're paying the same price. The difference is we're going to send you a check. Now, if you do nothing, you take no training, you, do, you don't do anything except 
sign up and do and, and just get your site in front of people. You'd make sixty nine dollars. Now, if you want to take you a little bit of training, you could do these on your own or, it, it, over time. Do a little bit of training. Do a little. Bit of, look, that could be as much as one hundred and ten dollars. Now, I want you. I want you to look at this. What about your other site, the Vortex? You can see that the total price is the same. So we're showing the public price, same price as Expedia, one thousand five ninety two. Here's the big difference. Your friend, your neighbor, your relative, that person goes to church with you, they're going to save $312. I, gotta, I just got to ask you a question. Do you know anybody that would be upset with you if you sent them to Vortex and they save $312 on a vacation they were already going to take? Well, the answer is absolutely not. Nobody's going to get offended by that. Well, look at this. They say 312. We send you a check for 187. Hey, let's do this again. Let's do a week at an all-inclusive. This is in Punta Cana. Okay. Dreams. Great resort. $430 is the price. You can see that whether you get it through Expedia or the person goes to your travel site. Again, asking the question. Somebody you know got the chance. Don't know, don't know about Expedia. They know you. Chances are they going to buy from you. And when they do, you make 150 to 240 bucks. But now look at this. You send them the Vortex. You see this, it's the same price retail, $3,009. But look at this. They save $500. Again, I'll ask the question, does anybody that you, do you know anybody? I mean, anybody that you know, even people who might not be crazy about you, if you sent them a link that saved them $500, wouldn't they buy from you? And when they buy from you and they say $500, we're going to send you a check for $300. I want you to know something. People will compare because of your relationship. That's why we pay you. See, we don't do advertising. We pay you. You are our advertising. And when you go out and tell people, when they come and check because of your relationship and they end up buying because it's the same price or less, when they buy, then we pay you. You are our advertising. That's how this works. And it can work for everybody who does it. I want you to know that this is more than a travel site, though. There are multiple places that you can, uh, that, that are some travel related. Most of them kind of travel a little bit, but like insurance. You can, you can people travel guard. There's three plans that your customers can choose from. All of them ensure the trip. All of them ensure baggage, travel medical. There's even some things you can do for specialized coverages if you should decide to do them. Okay, that's all available in your travel site. There's also Ticketmaster. You, you, when you, the, the day you open up your travel site with us, you are a ticket seller basically with the track with, with, with Ticketmaster. People go to your site, do concerts, they can do the arts, theater, sporting events. There's things they can do with family. It's the same inventory as Ticketmaster. Here's something you're gonna love this. Maybe you know somebody that's getting ready to get married. Possibly you know someone who's having a, 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 an anniversary. Did you know in your site, there's something called honeymoon wishes, anniversary wishes, that is destination specific. It's a registry that, you're, that, you, that you can set somebody who's getting married, set them up, destination specific, and then their friends and family can contribute toward a dream honeymoon. They can go in there and I'll, I'll buy one of 10 toward the airline tickets. I'll buy one of 12 toward the accommodations. I'll, folks, it's, it's lodging, it's, it's airline tickets, it's amenities, it's activities. It, folks, all those things can be done on your site. And then there's a place called Passport Visa Express that you can get everything with passport, new ones, where you can renew them. If you lost one, visas to over 150 countries. Now, what do all of these sites, all of them are on your travel site. They're kind of about travel, but they're not typical travel. What do they all have in common? You get paid. You get paid on everything that's on your site. Let's take a look at this. In addition to being a travel site, some of you may decide, you know what? I want to I kind of become a specialist. Maybe, maybe I, I, I really like cruising or I like all-inclusive resorts or maybe education or faith-based travel. All these things that, if, that, that you may look at or you may not even be considering it. But somebody says, hey, we've been thinking about doing a family reunion and we want to do a cruise. You just raise your hand and say, I can do those details. Well, why would you want to do those details? Because with groups, 
you can earn thousands of dollars per group and you can even go for free. That's what comes with your business. Now, you don't have to do this. You don't have to become the person who's a travel specialist. But should you desire, should you want to, you absolutely can with our company. There's also something called fam trips. Now, fam trips are short for familiarization, okay? In other words, there will be countries, resorts, cities, cruise ships, uh, tour companies that will say to an agent, now, First of all, you got to be trained. You got to be produ You got to be producing. You just can't get a card and go. Okay, but if you're a producing agent and and you're trained, look look at this. Here's a Caribbean four day fam trip. It includes airfare, and it's a hundred percent free. Look at this, Galapagos Islands. Tell me, it's the most one of the most unique places on earth. Seven days, $949. Here's a cruise line that is very popular in Europe. It's coming to the U.S. And they're offering seven to 14-day cruises for travel agents to come and check out their, their cruise ship and see what it's like. Oh, it's free. Here's nine days in Egypt. This includes a, a, like a, a, a one of the, I think one of the days, maybe one night, two days, is, is, uh, is, is on the Nile. On a, on a little one-day cruise, there's Dubai for $700 for six days. We got Greece, again, five days with a cruise in the Mediterranean, $549. I, I think you can see. Now, again, why do companies, why do countries do this? Because they know that if you come and have a great time and you see these things, that when you come home, you're going to start talking about, you won't believe where I just got back from. And boy, was it incredible. Man, I've never been to Dubai or Greece or Egypt, or I took this new cruise line. Folks, that's why these are available. Now, if you want it all, then you want to look at the tip. That's the travel owner package. It includes everything we've talked about, everything we've talked about with the tip, okay? Plus, there's access to wholesale travel pricing. You've got discounts on lifestyle purchases and the ability to earn free vacations on the purchases of your Vortex customers. Now, here's the extra savings. Remember the going to Manhattan for three nights? Well, look at this. If you go through your membership, you save $623. Folks, that, that, that's, that's an incredible savings for just one three-night three tri three trip, three-night trip. Here's the, that, that Dreams Resort, the, the, the all-inclusive for a week. Instead of paying $3,009, you pay $2,009. There's $1,000 in savings. And I just want to ask you this. I just want you to think. When time and money are no object, where will you go? And when I ask that question, and people say Hawaii, or I've got this uh, Mediterranean cruise, or I want to do Alaska or South America, you see all kinds. But folks, I want you to think about that. Where will you go? When you've earned your first $10,000 bonus with us, where will you go? You need to start thinking about that so we can start planning it. But see, there's also ways that you can shop at thousands of retail stores. This is just a very small sampling. And when you shop at these stores, you get reward credits. All right, I'll explain what those are in just a second. So you get the, the best deal you can get and you get reward credits for buying through your membership. There's also discounts at more than 18,000 restaurants. We'll talk about that a little bit more in just a second. So I want you to look at this. We're showing you how you can earn free vacations because there's reward credits on all of your personal travel, right? There's reward credits on your Vortex customer purchases. Now, so that's kind of like, you now, see on your own stuff, that's like credit card points on your credit card. But when you start talking about all your customers and you're getting the points for all their travel, that's like getting the points for a lot of people in their credit cards. I want, I want to tell you just a quick story. One of our people took a cruise with their family and earned enough reward credits on that cruise to go back later and have a one-week anniversary cruise with just the mom and dad. That was just off of one family trip. Here's what I want you to know. Those reward credits, they're not just for vacations. You can also use them you know, gift cards like Amazon, Apple. I was looking at the, there's like Petco, there's Walmart, there's, there's uh, Target. I mean, there's literally dozens of stores 
uh, Home Depot, I believe is another one, that you can take and you can exchange your reward credits for gift cards. We've had people who've done that, who bought washer and dryers, who've got uh, other appliances, okay? They, they've definitely taken vacation, bought airline tickets. This is what happens with the reward credits from all your personal purchases on travel and in the store, and then all of your customers, Vortex purchases. There's something else. The tip and top, include an anniversary reward trip. What is that? Well, if you remain active for 12 consecutive months, then you have the ability at, there's more than 2,000 resorts, four star, four plus star resorts, most of them seven nights, some places a little bit less, but, but, but you have the ability to do seven nights vacation after being active for 12 consecutive months. Just our way, just a small way of us saying thank you. Here's something else that both of the tip and top have. They have home business tax deductions. Now I'm not gonna get a whole big, this is gonna be a, a tax class. I just wanna cover some stuff. If you have a legitimate home business, now, it's key that it's legitimate. It's key that you can show intent to make a profit, which there's no easier way to do that than the travel business. Every time you pass out a business card, every time you get somebody to go to your site, it's attempting to be profitable. When you do that, you can deduct all or a portion of your cell phone, internet, the miles that you drive for your business. H&R Block says that when you're working out of your home, you can deduct a portion of your home expenses that are normally personal expenses. That means your utilities, rent or interest, maintenance, repairs, insurance, all those things can be partially deductible when you go to file your taxes. Plus those initial and monthly fees for your travel business are hundred percent tax deductible because it's for a business. Here's what I want you to hear this. This is based on national averages. So it's based on what people in New York City and LA pay for electricity and gas and that kind of stuff and what people in Alabama and in rural areas pay for it. But so it's the national average on all expenses, cell phone, internet, everything we've talked about. And using the most commonly filed tax bracket in America. So those are the things, if you're normal, and you file them in the most commonly filed tax bracket, here's what I'm telling you. The typical family could increase the tax refund by almost $2,700 per year. Per year. Why is that? Because the, our, the government encourages people to start businesses because some of those businesses will go on to become very big. Some of those businesses, look, I, I can think of, I get three, uh, three multi-billion, maybe trillion dollar businesses that started out of garages. You got Apple, you got Microsoft, you've got, uh, uh, you've got uh, uh, the dorm room with, uh, with Facebook and Google. folks, not every business is going to become like that, but some will. And that's why the government incentivizes people to open a business. So let's compare. We're going to compare the benefit because what we're looking at right now is the difference between Surge 365, working or having a travel agency, or having a travel club. Okay. Those are three different things. Because if you're going to open a travel agency, what I'm going to tell you is it's probably the cost is going to be more than $10,000. And you're going to have monthly expense with office and all the things that go with that. The travel club. Folks, a travel club not as good as what we have. I've seen I've seen a price more than ten thousand dollars. But let's look at the benefits of Search Three Sixty Five versus travel agency and travel club. You can see that as far as making money and travel, fam trips, and tax deductible business expenses, you can get those with a travel agency because it's about making money and travel. But you can't make money with a travel club. Now, a travel club has deep discounts on personal travel. Not all, but some have personal concierge. Let's give them the benefit of the doubt and say all of them do. Well, Surge has that. The travel agency doesn't, but the travel club does. But look, with Surge, you get a booking engine. You don't get that when you open up a travel agency. You, 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 you don't have a vortex with the ability to get free as many customers as you want. There's no reward credits on your personal travel and lifestyle purchases. There's nothing on your vortex customers that can be redeemed for vacations and gift cards. And there's... None of them, none, none of those offer 
an annual seven day vacation. So let's kind of look at the two packages, okay? Which is best for you? We're gonna compare the travel income package, we call it the tip, with the travel owner package called the top. Both are gonna include that Priceline powered booking engine. You point people, they go shop, it's the same price when they buy from you, they get the confirmation, you get a check. Then there's the Vortex discount booking engine. That's the one that's password protected because the prices are lower than can be shown to the public. You get that. Oh, with both of them, you have the ability to earn money on travel insurance and visas, passports, Ticketmaster, honeymoons, anniversaries. There's so much more that you can earn money with our company. Some of it not even, uh, not even attached to travel. Then with groups, oh my goodness. If you decide that you, you're going to do groups or you decide maybe that the group is going to, you're just going to end up volunteering. Folks, you can make thousands and go free. Be productive as a, as, as a, as a travel representative. Folks, discounted even free trips. Then there's the legitimate tax deductions that could save you thousand tax. Let me just ask you a question, okay? No, I, I tell you what. Let me let me finish this up. There's so there's a seven day annual vacation with both. Now with the top, there's deep discounts on personal travel. You got the concierge and reward credits for your personal, okay, and customer. Then you can redeem those for travel gift card. Let's look at these, okay? Total price for the tip, one time two ninety nine monthly ninety nine dollars ninety five cents. The top. $200 more one time. So, so $499 total, the same $99.95 per month. Now, I, I, just, want, I, I, I just want to, to, to think about this just, just a second. Because what, what if the true cost was zero? You say, okay, how is that possible? You just showed me there's a price. Well, there is. But look at ways you can recoup your annual fees with the tip of the top. First of all, there's the increased tax refund. Do you remember a couple of slides ago said that if you're a typical person, average expenses, working our business, filing the most common tax bracket, it's filed. The increase in your tax refund would be $2,700, about, okay? So it could be a little bit more, it could be a little bit less, it could be a lot more, it could be a lot less, depending on a lot of circumstances. Okay, but think about this, for the top package, 500 one time, 99.95 a month. In the first year, you'd spend a total of $1,600. I just showed you with the increased tax refund that you're typical, that the government's going to increase your tax refund 2,700. It sounds crazy, but it actually costs you money to not have our business. Then there's the annual seven-day vacation. Folks, that by itself could be worth more than the fees. Then you've got productive agents, maybe taking one fam trip a year. Again, a way that's worth more than the fees. Then with the top, folks, you understand if you dine out one time a week, and most people I talk to dine out at least once, maybe more. But if you dine out once a week and use our dining, our restaurant package, do you know that just by using that package, you could save more than it costs you a year? Just dining out once a week using our stuff. You, you could use the membership, maybe take a couple of vacations. I want you to understand everything we've talked about. It, this doesn't include you making a dime in, our, in travel. Nobody buys. It's, I mean, it, think about that. It, it sounds impossible that if you tell people about it and it's the same price or less, it sounds impossible that there won't be people who buy from you. I believe it's impossible. Okay. There's one other, there's one other feature. If you're a junior executive, I know you are because we're talking right now. Junior executives who purchase the top package, in other words, the travel owner package, are qualified to override. You'll hear sometimes say QTO, that's qualified to override. What does that mean? It means that you're qualified to earn 100% of the compensation plan in Surge 365. You know, I, I, I want you to think about this because I'm sure as you're sitting there right now, you're thinking, man, this, this just makes a lot of sense. Because if it makes sense to you, it's going to make sense to others. Do you know with our company, if this makes sense to six other people, whether they buy the tip or the top, you understand your monthly fee at that point goes away. As long as those six or any six stay active, do you understand that when that happens, you got a $60 a month residual? So not only did you, did you get your $99 waived, but you made 60 bucks. See, why do we do this? We want you to be incentivized to tell others about Search 365. So basically, I got one question for you. 
which is best for you? Is that making money with the travel income package or do you want it all with the travel owner package? Which one fits you best?